all dear student welcome to my channel economics study point by jitendra kumar today under this video i will discuss uh, another problem of uh, uh, aspermann rank correlation co coefficient and for that purpose i have written a questions uh, which uh, frequently ask in igno ma economics examination and questions what the question tells us a random sample of 10 college student is selected and their grade in mathematics and economics are found to be mathematics uh, say capital x and economics marks say capital y calculate a spearman rank correlation coefficient before starting of video i request you please subscribe my channel for getting early notification of my upcoming video now let us start solution of this problem first write information separately 90 In this question, only actual data are given, but no rank are given. First of all, we have to give rank either taking one as a highest value or taking one as a lowest value. But in this question, I will take one as a highest value. First, first of all, we have to draw a table. denoted by small x rank in mathematics is denoted by small x i am i am taking one as a highest value first find out highest value here 90 99 99 99 first rank get 90 second 82 88 okay 88 get second rank and 82 gets third rank now move in 70 73 here yes get fourth rank now 60 plus 
60 plus 60 plus here here 4 5 6 rank ok now move to 50 plus no 40 plus here 45 40 45 gets 7 rank 40 gets 8 rank 30 32 32 gets 9 rank 30 gets 10 rank now marks in eco economics marks in economics here i have written 85 42 75 68 75 68 45 63 63 60 90 60 90 62 58 find highest number 90 giving 90 as a one rank first rank Ninety, eighty-five get second rank. Seventy, seventy, seventy-five here one get third rank. Now move to sixty plus sixty, sixty-three. 68, 62. Okay, 68 is the highest getting fourth rank. 63 gets fifth rank. 62 gets sixth rank. 60 gets seventh rank. gets 8th rank 45 gets 9th rank 42 gets 10th rank differences differences between ranks two ranks x rank in economics say small y Differences equal to x minus y. 1 minus 2 minus 1. 10 minus 10, 0. 3 minus 3, 0. 7 minus 4, 3 plus 3. 9 minus 9, 0. 6 minus 5, plus 1. 8 minus 7 plus 1, 2 minus 1 plus 1, 4 minus 6 minus 2, 5 minus 8 minus 3. D a square. Minus 1 a square, 1, 0, 0. 3, 3, 3 into 3, 9, 0, 1, 1, 1, 4, 9. Summation of DSY equal to 9, 1, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13 and 4. 17 and 17 and 9, 26. Summation of d square. That is the 
sum of the square of differences of rank equal to 26. Now, we know that the formula for calculation of a spare man <coughs> rank correlation coefficient equal, equal p equal to p denoting a spare man rank correlation coefficient equal to 1 minus 6 summation of d square by n into n my n square minus 1 and n number of observation you can count it there are 10 students it is written in questions okay 10 and summation of d square equal to 26 now just uh, substitute everything n and the summation of d square in order to get the uh, a spare man rank correlation coefficient equal to 1 minus 6 into 26 the summation of d square equal to 26 n 10 into 10 square minus 1 1 minus One one fifty six ten into hundred minus one. That is one minus one fifty six ten into ninety nine equal to one minus one fifty six nine nine. Zero. If uh, 156 is uh, divided by 990, 990, we get figure like uh, this, uh, 0.1571, 5757 uh, dot dot dot. In round up, it can be written 1.1. Uh, 0.16 when subtracted by uh, when <coughs> one is uh, subtracted by 0.16 we get uh, plus uh, 8 0. Point, 0. Point 0.84 this is uh, a spare man rank correlation coefficient and uh, I think uh, everybody got it. The thing I wanted, I wanted to tell you under this video. And thanks for watching my video till end. Jai Hind.